now we are going to start the exercises uh, in chapter 1 first roman number write the numbers shown on the spike backus this is a backus figure so they have uh, what uh, they have given the uh, uh, they have given the uh, dots on the lines so we have to count the dots on the line and finally you have to write it in the blank okay first term that is first sum is a so we start with ones always so 1 2 3 4 5 6 how many 1 2 3 4 5 6 doll uh, 6 dots or you have to consider as a balls whatever you have okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 6 ones and after that um, there is no uh, when the dots are there is no balls in the tens place so you have to put zero then 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so in 100 place how many so how many in under place value what is the uh, how many dots in the line how many dots or how many balls 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 dots so 7 you have to write and after that what you are going to do this is 1000 there is no balls so you have to you have to put 0 or dots so 0 then 10,000 you have to write how many uh, balls how many balls that is 2 and lakhs how many only 1 so this is what you have to write I, i'll repeat once again write the numbers shown on the spike backus this is the backus method so what you're going to do so first we have to write it we have, we have uh, the picture is given in the book so you have to count the balls otherwise you have to count the dots i consider as a dot but you have to consider as a imagine is a backus kit so you have to consider these dots as a ball okay so how many dots are here one two in ones place one two three four five six ones and in thousand sorry in tens there is no dots so i put zero in hundred place so what is the dots how many dots are here one two three four five six seven dots so i write seven in ten thousand see there is no sorry ten, not ten thousand thousand there is no dots i put zero in ten thousand how many dots one two dots i just draw only two so i've written only two in lakhs how many only one so only one dot so i've written one so how you're going to write how you're going to write you have to write like this and after that you have to say once tens in ones place six ones in tens place there is no number so i put zero in hundred place how many hundreds are how many numbers in hundred seven hundreds so you have to write seven hundred and six in thousand place there is no number so i put zero in ten thousand place how many how many ten thousand two ten thousand in lakhs only one so you have to write so i've told you already from the uh, from the left from yes yeah of course uh, from sorry from the right you have to look at this number so from the right that means you have to uh, omit the three numbers three digits that is not om numbers three digits that is one period you just left over and after that you start put uh, start putting the comma so what is the number 1,20,706 this is the number you have to read so while you write 1,20,706 you have to write I will write it on this first 1,20,706 how to write 1 lakh Seven hundred and six. This is what the right. This is what you have to write. This is the number names. So don't forget. This is the what place value chart. So this is the abacus. Uh, this is abacus method. Spike abacus. So uh, the picture is given in the book itself. So you have to consider these dots or these uh, consider these dots. Actually, if you have a abacus kit, we are consider only the balls. But this is a diagram. So you have to consider as a dot. First, we have to start with the ones. So ones. How many num? How many dots? Means six dots. And uh, tens. There is no dots. So I 
I put 0. In 100, 7 dots, I have written 7. In 1000, there is no dot, I put 0. In 10,000, there is 2 dots, so I put 2. In lakhs, only 1 dot, I have written. So, from the right, you have to omit, other you have to left over the 3 digit. That means, once period, you have to what left over and after that you have to start putting the comma after two two digits so uh, 20 you have to put a comma then you have only one digit you have to put a comma so how we are going to read that is six ones and zero tens and seven hundreds and zero thousand and two uh, two ten thousand and one lakh so if you write if you uh, write as it is then you have to start reading one lakh twenty thousand seven hundred and six this is what you have to read and this is what you have to write this is a number name so i've written the number name one lakh twenty thousand seven hundred and six so we'll go for the next sum so we start with always ones place so in the ones place how many digits sorry when the ones place first you have to write the place value and this a diagram or this picture is given in the book this is the second sum we are going to solve so in the ones place how many dots are here three dots so you have to one two three three dots so i've written three so tens place there is no number there is no dot not number there is no dot you have to put zero in hundred place how many dots one two three four dots you have to write four as it is then in thousand place how many dots one two three you have to write three as it is in ten thousand place how many dots two dots so i told you already you start with what right hand side right from the right you have to start so one uh, once place three ones tens place zero tens and hundred place four hundreds and in thousand place three thousand in ten thousand place what twenty thousand so what you're going to do so f that is three zero and four these three digit you have to what left over and you start putting the comma so twenty three thousand this is twenty and three you have to combine together this is a thousand period this is fully what period thousand period okay thousand period and these three is called as a ones period okay i've told you once period so this is thousand so already we learned this is a thousand period this is a once period so how we are going to write twenty three thousand four hundred and three so you have to read twenty three thousand four hundred and three while you start writing this is a number name so twenty three thousand twenty three thousands and four hundred and three four hundred four hundred and three no need to write and okay twenty three thousands four hundred and three this is what you have to what write this is a number name this is what you have to write okay next sum third sum we are going to now we are going to move on the third sum now we are going to solve the third sum this is uh, the picture is given in the book itself that's so we are going to solve this sum so first you start with the ones place you have to count the dots one two three four five five dots write five as it is and tens place there is no dots so you have to put zero then hundred place how many dots two dots and thousand place no dots so you have to put zero so in ten thousand place only one so i have told you you always start with the right from the right you have to start so these three digit this three digit is a ones place the ones period this three is a this three is a ones period and these two is a what thousand period this is once and these two is a thousand period okay so i've told you you have to just left over the last three digit and you have to put a comma so how you're going to read ten thousand two hundred and five ten thousand two hundred five ones and zero tens two hundreds and zero thousand and one ten thousand so this is one tens hundred and thousand and ten thousand so ten thousand two hundred and five this is what you have to read and while you start writing the number name you write ten thousand ten thousands two hundred two hundreds 
and 5 and 5 this is what you have to write